What's up guys? Welcome back, I'm Daily Fix. We're playing Final Fantasy and I promise you that today I might not get sidetracked. So yesterday we... Yesterday? No, it's the day before that. We, we actually did the Beast Tribes. We got all of them... Um, not all of them completely finished, as you know. Because of... Uh, what's the button again? C. Here you go, Reputation. Uh, the XLE. Uh, we need a crafter to do so, and we kind of don't have one. Uh, we do need to do something about it. Look at these, man. Look at this. This is junk. Oof. <laughs> Item level 30. 20, uh, 16. Oh, my God. They're so low. They are absolutely low. Boy, what can I do about it right now? Not much. Let's get to the right window. So, it's going to be... It's probably pirates... Is um, the one main storyline we'll start doing today. And I'm excited about that. Also, I really need to do this. I meant to do so. Uh, yeah, lost stream, but I didn't. No mistakes were made. Anyways. Let's go down the dock. Actually, let's go up here. Because that's where we need to go. And I wonder how far we will get today. Um, hopefully. Level 45 MSQ wise. I'm aware there is still a lot. A lot of story to go. Uh, and, and actually that, that's not an understatement. Oh my god. That is so, so much we still need to do. Anyways. As I told the professor, in a many uh, misses of uh, missive. Oh wow, this is a great start, isn't it? Missivis. Why can't you say in many letters? I believe that the area surrounding Ferris Sirius is repeat, repleted with corrupt crystals of exceptional strength. Unfortunately, I've yet to test my hypothesis. As all access to the Isle of Umbra is prohibited at present. For some reason unknown to me, you see my attempt to acquire this information has often met with annoyances and disdain. It's rather puzzling since I've always taken the time to explain my motivations in great detail to the subject of my questioning. Mayhap you will have better luck wrestling information from these yellow jackets. I've all but given up at this point. Okay, we'll, uh, we'll take a look what's going on. Uh, yellow... Is that one up here? Yeah, you are most awkwardly placed. Of out of everyone posted here. How do you get up here? I think this door should be opened. Like, you should be able to open that door. And then go from up here. Are you, are you hiding from duty? Ah, don't startle me. Don't you know better than to speak upon a person at a time like this? With all of that... fattiest gossip of spirits and spectres hunting the Isle of Umbra. Just because I know it's nonsense doesn't make it less frightening. Okay, so they have ghost problems then. Send me at them. I can scare away ghosts. Hunter Scholar. Wait. Someone was there. Well, you look kind of cool. Yeah, you kind of look cool. I like that. Frickman. Uh, you're keen on traveling to the Isles of um, uh, Umbra. Bloody hells, lass. Are you drunk or just crazy? Ain't nothing there but death. Death and more death. That sounds like a holiday to me. Uh, down below, arrow pointing down. Can I jump here? Yeah, 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 I can. There you go. The Isles of Umbra. What interest have you in a godforsaken place? Ever since we uh, we uh, we were forced to abandon Pharaoh Sirius, the Isles have become not more. Than a graveyard for ship unable to navigate the shores. 
and the purgatory for the souls dragged down from the depths with them. Alright. We'll see how that will go. Let me change my mic position here because I'm annoyed with it. I think this is just as well. I don't know. If you hear anything, like... Like, if it sounds less, then let me know. I kind of want to see my keyboard, and I sometimes just don't. Also, I don't want to talk directly into it, because I... Breathe. Heavy. Yeah. So, yeah, one of the things that I kind of want to start doing with this particular character... Is doing the missions for the Beast Tribes. And also doing more dailies. Now, I don't think it is necessary up to the end of a realm reborn because uh, then you actually start getting some decent gear and gear starts to matter quite a bit you'll have more dungeons that are uh, more gear heavy they'll have like item levels that you need to reach it's not oh wait i see it's up there again it's not that drastic but i think that is when i want to focus more of my attention as well on the daily activities Instead of just doing the MSQ, and I know I won't show everything because by the end of the day, it's all about just running those dungeons, doing those missions. I uh, will probably dedicate one stream to me doing those. Um, not just now; we just don't we don't have that much. We have the leveling and we have the guild task, and I don't even have all of the guilds. Like level, level twenty five, with my level currently forty five, we should be able to do all of them. So we have a lot to unlock. I believe that's up to level 40, 45. I'm not particularly sure about it just yet. Also, we don't have raids, and yeah. So, you no, know, we'll uh, we'll we'll start doing that kind of stuff when we have more things to do. And PvP, maybe maybe we'll look into PvP. I don't know. Apparently you can get some cool mounts playing the PvP game. Uh, I'm not sure. So yeah. Ah, Une, you've returned. Tell me of your findings. Really? Infested with the undead, you say? That's, that is very, very... That's a very, very interesting development. Excuse me for a moment while I gather my thoughts. This is weird. Worry not, my friend. I've given your findings some thought, and I've concluded that this talk of spirit is not more than local folklore. As for why all travels to the Isle of Umbra is restricted, well, mayhap it's considered too dangerous. Owing to the aband owing to the abandonment of Ferris Sirius. So Ferris Sirius is most likely than the dungeon on that island. Well uh, yes, well anyways. While you were questioning those yellow jackets, I paid a visit to the local pub. Since every, uh, since even an esteemed scholar like myself enjoy dulling her wits on occasion. Would you have been drinking? <laughs> Damn you. It was all there that I heard the tale of a man named Skyfren, who was recently detained after returning from... Wait for it. The Isles of Umbra! Dum, dum, dum. This is the first I've heard of someone actually traveling to and from there, so I'm curious to how he obtained permission. Mind having a chat with him in my stead? He was arrested after all, so I'm somewhat re to approach him myself. Oh, yeah, you're worried about your reputation. I get that. Of course. Why wouldn't you? Let's summon my chocobo. Speaking of chocobo, it, uh, uh, let's take a look at Penion. Still level 6. We'll get there. That's too much green. Yeah, you can't go above a hour, so that was just a waste of green there. Don't waste the green, guys. Don't waste the greens. Can't wait for more mounts. I, I know I can buy one. And we'll get a lot more because I want to do the, um... Uh, the... Oh, shit. What's the name again? The Extremes. Oh, I'm not looking forward to Titan. I really don't look forward to Titan. I had such a horrible time with that one. Yes, I have to go back. She called to me. Sings to me. Um... 
Mind, um, uh, um, tell Mimidoa, I'm sorry. Give him this. He was, he was right. Or, or you could release me. Yes, yes, release me. I will go and tell her. Uh, let me, let me go to her. Wait, she has a chocobo feather. What you want with a chocobo feather, bro? So yeah, I'm, I'm thinking that uh, at some point, like, especially when we start, like, Heaven's Ward, I want to start changing a tiny bit of the setup. We just don't only want to run MSQ. It will prolong this journey till endgame. It's not all about endgame in this game. It's definitely not. There are so many things I need to do. Like, I don't have my gatherers. I don't have crafters. I just have three classes. These three over here. And it feels empty. But I'm waiting till the end of Heaven's War to start with crafters. But I might do gatherers sooner. Have a few fishing expeditions at some point for my, um, my fishes. I want to see if I can get everything to 100%. That also includes the... I don't know if you can see the fish guide or the fish log, one or the other. So yeah, we have a lot of things. Sightseeing. It's, it's a lot of things we want to do. Anyways. Uh, what did Skyfell have to say? Hmm. That's not terribly helpful. I couldn't care less about... Uh, uh, care, care about... Oh my god, I couldn't care less how much he misses his favorite bar wrench. What was that about a man named Mimideo? Wait, I know the name. That's the bastard who grabbed my ass the other day in the pub. <laughs> well, what you did? Oh my god. Well, if you want to give him that feather, be my guest. I'm not going anywhere near him and his wandering hands. All right then, start running. Maybe he just tried to get her attention. Oh no, maybe not. Like, this doesn't. Look at that. You know what he's trying to do, isn't it? Ah. Uh, you are a little pervert. Ah. Uh, uh, Nofa. Net yet? Are you? Uh, I don't know what that means. That's fine. Uh, another initiative. Initiative? No, alright. Anyways, now, when, what are you? Speak up, miss. Can't hear you. Ah, bugger me. Is this what I think it is? Nah, couldn't be. You found this, you said? Where did he, uh, where did you say you found it? Skyfe, you say? Well, hoping to have a word with the lad. But it sounds like there's not left. Twi uh, there's not left twixt his ears? He was supposed to help patch up Paraserius, he was. Company sent us to supervise a lot of them. Uh, we aren't getting work done on their own. Half of them walk off, half of them ran off, half of them... Up vanished. What's that? You'll be looking for fa uh, for passage to the Isle of Umbra? Why didn't you say so? I've been thinking of dispatching someone to take a look on behalf of old uh, Mimi Deo. Mimi Doa. Tell him how the land lies. Ain't nobody been interested until you came. Colin. I, I really hate this place. I'm so sorry. I can't. Sp you know, this is so difficult. The whole port's up in arms about spirits and so forth. If I had the gill, I'd hire some self swords and let them sort it out. But you'll do in a pinch. You will. Show this parchment to the skipper and he'll see you there and back. And he can go back trying to grab us. Okay, where's the ship? Oh, I need to go back to, to that...
collar. Or not? I think I do. No, I don't. Uh, yes, that's, that's, I do. Never mind. Never mind. I'll get the wood done. Yeah, I, I don't know if I can actually reach the end of A Realm Reborn this week. It's a lot. Especially with the post, post uh, Realm Reborn. And there's some raids I need to be doing. Alright, so you went and had a word with Mimi. I will call him Mimi from now on. I hope a, uh, I hope the valuable time you saw fit to waste. Um, whoa, 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 whoa. I hope the valuable time you saw fit to waste amounted to something. You saw fit to waste. You said, oh, she's such a twat. You mean that disgusting creature was kind of a superior? I find it hard to believe, but this writ of passage does appear to be genuine. So it must be true. I must say, it is a relief to work with such an industrious woman as you. I look forward to hearing of the discoveries you will make on the Isle of Umbra without me. Always something with these, aren't they? There we go, level 42 still. Fine, fine, I failed to see the justification for dragging me along your journey. But if you insist, I will go as well. But 12 as my witness, if you leave me behind to be devoured by some horrid abomination, I shall come back to hunt you. Oh, the skipper's over there. I didn't even see that guy. I just saw him. All right, fairy skipper. Ah, take me to the Isle of Umbra, see bits. As if it's that simple as... Oh, I see you got a rite of passage. All right, then. Climb aboard. Just as easy as that. Easy as pie. There we are. She is actually here. Did not expect that. This doesn't seem all that bad. I'm not saying I like to build a summer home here, but... Oh, the hell's with this. Here, take your pot and go on without me. You've uh, harvested corrupted crystals before, right? So this isn't as though you require my assistance. Speak to the man guarding the gate. I'm sure he let you in. Now, if you would please excuse me... She bloody buggered off. Joking, right? Oh well. Uh, monsters here, level 40. Probably won't get too much out of my chocobo. Beg your pardon, ma'am. But how did you come here? Access to the island is currently restricted. I have a pot that will help you. An old pot. I'm not sure I follow. Oh, I see. You wish to harvest a corrupted crystal. Sorry, friend, but you have to return empty-handed. The right master, Mimi, gave you... Uh, the right master, Mimi, gave you may grant you access to the aisle, but only authorized personnel may proceed past this point. Why, you ask? Look up and see for yourself. Oh, well, there's a boulder. When the giant mass of crystal struck the lighthouse, it caused severe damage to both the structure and the machinery within that once powered the beacon. Ah, contrary to what the small folk would have you believe, the fires of Pharaoh Sirius were not the produ uh, product of a mage trauma traumaturgy. Traumaturgy. Taumaturgy. I know it's a black mage at some point, but or a colossal arcane bomb, but an elaborate con contraption fueled by uh, ethereal energy. Bears are still ongoing, but it's anyone's guess 
when they'll be complete. What's worse, all work has ceased since rumors of Walking Dead drove off the entire crew. Not that those rumors are incorrect. I've observed the fiends from a distance at the ship graveyard to the south. That's drawn, uh, that's drawn them to our shores. Well, what's drawn them to our shores is still a mystery, though. I'll make you a deal, you know? Help me unravel this mystery and I'll bring you the corrupted crystal. In fact, I shall begin searching for one that satisfies your requirements. As for where to begin your inquiries into the situation, it so happens that a part of tr three adventurers came ashore not long ago seeking to salvage valuable trinkets at the ship's graveyard. I'd be surprised if they knew nothing of the undead infestation, so it might behoove you to question them. I'll start with them. Fine. But just go there. They came here not knowing anything and you let them ashore even though I need a rite of passage. You know, it makes perfect sense. They are actually here. Well, I'll be damned. This all there, f uh, this all there for the taking. Five bleeding years worth of wrecks and their cargo, but those queer, queer dead things and that voice. Actually, that voice was quite nice. Oh, great! Hey, how we doing, man? I know. I, I think you let in troll again, right? End up great. All right, it's good to have him back then. You know, felt bad about it. You saw them too, right? Dead people just shambling about without a care in the world, except when they do seem to care. That is, and start fumbling towards the water. Uh, I did. I did. Um, I, I did want to talk with Sora before he actually got back, uh, but it ended up perfectly. Actually. Because he also talked to her. And then, in my opinion, you know, it all ended well. Yeah, Louise. God, that voice, that sing single fleeting verse. I can still hear it. Stay clear of the southern shores, friend. I took every ounce of my strength to resist. Alright. Run for safety. Run for death. I guess we'll choose the ladder. Is David? Hmm. The stock of a alluring voice is disturbingly familiar, as if. But that's impossible. They're all dead, aren't they? But if they have returned, that would mean. Oh, beg your pardon. It was just, I'm thinking about something. Which reminds me, I received word that Master Mimi would be arriving any moment. Apparently, he grew frustrating waiting for the sweet young lass with a skin as soft as Phoenix Down to return. Which I assume is you. Oh, if he touches me, he dies. <laughs> I don't know what sort of arrangement you had. But you should probably go I should probably go and explain yourself. Are you kidding me? Let's take a look actually. Can we just see because they're referring to something striking? I can't even look up that far. It's kind of a pain. Oh well. Oh, there's actually a bloody bridge. Oh now I see there's something yellow struck in there. Uh, we should probably be able to see from um, the port. Let's get out of the... Oh, let's not zoom into my behind. What's keeping your initiative? Okay, initiative. Initiative. Is it initiative? Whatever, I ain't getting any younger, you know? Eh. Some honey-voiced... A honey-voiced harlot been calling out for folk that wandered near the ship graveyard. And it's stirring up the dead and all. 
Bloody hell. Takes me back to the days as a cannon boy sailing under old Misbit. But they wouldn't dare, would they? Not after the lesson we learned them uh, last time. <sighs> the bloody wood, though. Wouldn't they, brazen old? Biddies. Some folks say uh, sad as the first purge would be the last. But I knew, knew deep down in my bones as this day would come. And come it has, I. I better... I better me burn... Bum ear a sirens behind all of this. Nay, not one of the Vanquin variety initiative. I just, 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 why do you keep calling me this weird thing? I don't know. I speak of another kind. Them, them what's got feathers and learn sailors to the watery grave with a sweet, sweet song. Oh, but I don't end here. No. Downing just the start. No drownings just the start. See, even the death, even in death, a man stays bound to the beast, forced to do her bit till his corpse can do no more. This is a tale I wouldn't wish upon your worst enemies, except maybe in drink. And I'd regret it afterwards. Anyway, it's up to us to stop. This hell-born hussy of four C takes another soul. Cause we can't send you march enough to war without these. The sirens don't have power over the man over a man as can't hear a song. So we will get something to plug our ears. It's lucky for you I carry a spare pair. And lucky for the both of us. I'm superstitious I'm a superstitious old salt. I kinda hope I never have to talk to this guy again. Well, she ain't coming to us, so we'd better head over to her. To the shipyard. Alright. Yeah, so this is indeed a dungeon. I think we'll actually go there at some point. Maybe not now. Oh, we might actually find something to... Kill for like the hunts? Not sure. I've not done hunts in a while though. I started so adamant about it, but uh, yeah. Well, that ended up not doing anything. What are you? That's a level 50. Yeah, I don't think I'll I'll be um, I'll be taking that down. Uh, here you are. I should actually start with uh, Overpower Temporal Tempest to get that 30 second timer going and then start the rotation. Well, oh well. That's for later. If she passes near the shore, she'll sure to spy the camp. Uh, she'll if she passes near the shore, she'll sure to spy the campfire and come looking. Just a matter of waiting now. Luckily, he stays quite a safe distance. Level 46, I'm 45. Should be fine. Oh, actually, I'll take, I'll take it back. I'll take it back. Take you something. Oh, I have to be careful. I filled up my cup. Quite a bit. Hmm, I'm getting to wonder if some sly bugger ain't spun us a yarn here. Yeah. Quiet. Did you hear that? It's her. Look, look out over the water. She's coming. She comes. Ah, 
Uh, kind of looks like Garuda. I think. Quick, lass. Shove them plugs in your ear and get ready for a fight. Soon as you realize her, uh, you're deaf to her ditties, she'll call on the trolls and we'll be up to our necks in corpus before you know it. How do you know that? How does he know that? Alright. Right, she's singing. Like hell I'm doing this. She's a bard? I think she is a bard. Two love sprung a cruel tree reward. Alright. I guess. Yeah, we'll go to you then. It's fine. Start with that. Tempest. Get that 30 second up. And we'll get... Damage increase. But it would also include us healing more. Fractures. Wounds are bleeding, causing damage over time. I'll, I'll live. Come on. And I, try, I'll, I will try to keep that up at all times. So that would mean... To do it right now again. So far it's quite easy. Born for Mistress Distress. It's not a song. Why? 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 Now what? Come on. Send me another group. Last breath of death? Regret forever. This song makes no sense. Absolutely none. My love, a river, one look, soul, shiver. Alrighty then. He has a charmed captain. Well, he doesn't look very charmed now, does he? Oh, there's another one. What the hell are you guys doing? Get this mage first. Should hit him before the second start, like the buff is done. Yeah, that was easy. Okay, now what? No more dark eclipse, the heart? She's just rambling like, I don't know, like old story text. It's weird, man. Ah. Am I alright? Ha, huh? I'm better than that. Happy as a sailor in a in a whorehouse. I am. Wow. We love to spend money. Cause I'd be happy as a sailor with two. Two what's it? If I'd Got it, the song trust. I saw for a moment there, my brain is like, does he say? And then you can figure out the letters that my brain is like fitting in there, but it includes a T over here. Like this letter would be gone, and it would include this word over there. But that's my brain. Ah, uh, but you can't have everything, can you? She'll not come crowning round here again, though. How do you know? How did you? How do you know she won't be back? Not fair for a whiny road. If she does, well, we know what to do, don't we? Thank for your help. Bugger me. I've clean forgotten your name. Remind me, Une. 
don't recall having uh, having no initiative by that name. But if you're not one of my old mates, what's the name? Who's the name? Why have you been so bloody helpful? Uh, never mind. Be seeing you, Lassie. Wait, you thought I was one of your. Ah, oh, you thought I was one of his subordinates. You got to be kidding me. I kind of want to see what's over there. I don't know why. It just feels like there's something over there as well. Moonshade Island. So maybe in the future we'll get there. There is a magic pot over here. Let's get rid of this damn bird. I want to talk to that magic pot. See what he does. If we can do anything with it. I don't believe I actually never was here. Okay, I couldn't. Okay. Um, give me an elixir. Wind up moon. Poe can adjust elevation. Poke to inform others of its location. Blown kiss to get a strange look from passes by. Needs a high elixir. And another one needs a, a, a high... Yeah, it needs an elixir. Wound up sun. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, okay, that's just the thing. What, what is this? With this minion, the sun will never go down on you. Poke to adjust elev... Wait. Is this... Would we have always daylight if we have this? Elixir and high elixir. I have to go back here. Uh, small talk. Give me an elixir. Well, that is actually small talk. Yeah, I like that. Uh, where the hell do I need to go? Need to go to the dock. Let's go then. I wonder about that. I've not used, like, minions. Um, that's not true. I don't own... I only own these two. I don't know what they do. He's obedient. This one is independent. Is there is there something special about minions? I know there's one that I really like. And it's one of them. I think it's a koala. And this koala just... Um, if you summon him. He'll... Uh, start on the ground and then he moves his way up and goes sits on your shoulder. I think it's brilliant. Other than that, I don't know what minions do. If they do anything, but I want to have them all. You mean it was a siren? But how were you able to resist the song? I see. But I heard Master Mimi had involved, uh, was involved in the first purge, but I never actually... Having survived an ordeal like that, I can't blame him for carrying earplugs around with him. Anyways, I have something for you. The corrupted crystal you wanted, safely sealed within a pot, just as you requested. Please take it with my compliments. Okay, where do we need to go then? Go back to Illport. Let's uh, just spend a bit of money. Uh, we're only, we're actually over 200,000, which it's, it's nothing. We could have had more if I started doing daily dungeons and stuff. And I didn't. Who's actually online? Maybe we can arrange something. Uh, not too many. Ah, she's up there. I keep messing that up. There we go. Oh, it's you. Welcome back, Kuna. You're looking remarkably hale. I must say, and more importantly, alive. Are you alive? Aren't you? You are alive, aren't you? Yeah, okay, that's, that's how you go. That's fine. Ah. The conquering, hero, the conquering hero returns bearing a gift. Might I have a closer look? Impressive. Very impressive indeed. Yes. I think this will be. I think you'll be quite pleased with this specimen. Congratulations, Une. Salmon, have I ever? Salmon, if ever have I encountered a corrupted crystal, a crystal composed of such a violent over and of fire aspect either. 
Leveling dungeons do be useful. Yeah, I should run them more often. Um, at some point, this character will take over from Daily Fix. I will probably remove Daily Fix. Might probably rename this character to, I don't know, Une Daily Fix or Daily Fix Docin. I don't know how I'll do it. We'll, let, uh, we'll decide about that later. Um, and, and just have some fun with that. Not, not MSQ stuff, because I will stream that. But everything I've unlocked, I can do with this character. So yeah, looking forward to that. What, well, you wanted a corrupted crystal composed of ice inspect either to... Are you bloody kidding me? You got to be kidding me. Uh, when you... When I ran into me, there was no camera over my head, right? Uh... No. Uh... How do you do that? Uh, link shells. Give me a second here. Uh, no. Wasn't... Streaming then. I am now. So you wanted a corrupted crystal composed of ice and expected either to contract the effects of a raging wind. Ha! <laughs> uh, well, this specimen won't help you there. Anyone who knows anything about elements could tell you that. You'll just have to keep looking, I suppose. Oh. Oh. What I meant. Um, then I, then, 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 I'm blank. Let's talk to her again. I think she'll send us back to, to that guy. Like, don't fret now. I know exactly where you, where to find a corrupted crystal composed of ice aspect at Eva. An associate of mine in Gradania has been studying the effect of such, of one such crystals on living be. Wait, you doing war? Ah, that's what, um, that's, what's with the expression? I thought you would be pleased to hear this news. This is not another wild dodo chase, I assure you. And what's even better is that this time you needn't use a wooden pot of yours to protect yourself from the crystal's energies. Indian's findings suggest that it's quite safe. Why you ask? Well, let's just say this that it was undergone a unique process that has rendered such precaution unnecessary anyway do not let me keep you i it has been a pleasure and come back and see me sometimes all right let that's not that's not i found a 380 gigabyte rec recording on before wow wow that is a massive video. <laughs> uh, let's take a look. Where the hell do we need to go? Just Crudania. Would this be a higher level then? I think it's an easy walk over here. Oh, we actually have to be all the way over there. Ah, uh, never mind. Never mind. Just take the uh, the crystal. Uh, it's probably a key combo you used. I'm playing. Uh, Aoife, uh, Old Gradana, and we'll just go over there. Okay. Greetings and salutations, Miss Dawson, I presume? CNN informed me of your adventures in Ilport. Terribly sorry about the misunderstanding. Though, as Professor Lambert is fond of saying, no actions taken in the name of science is every, ever truly wasteful. 
To the matter at hand, corrupted crystals possessing the properties you seek can be found in abundance at the standing uh, courses following the calamity. Alas, that is no longer the case and while there is, well, there is at least one suitable crystal that remains to be found within the 12th wood, precisely where it is at any given moment is more difficult to say. Permit me to explain. You are familiar with Spriggans, yes? The furry little rascals that are... That are won't to seek out ore and other stone. The furry little red that are won't to set out... What a weird sentence again. Well, one such creature with a infamous insoluble appetite has single-handedly devoured every corrupted crystal in the Twelve's Wood. Fortunately for you, these crystals take an entire uh, eternity to digest. Are we going to be killing it? Oh yeah, that's going to be cured. That that's going to be happening. Assuming they can even be digested, and I'm reasonably confident that one still resides within his guts. There we go. It's quite fascinating, really. My theory is that this uh, Gigaty first consumed a corrupted crystal, then. You couldn't care less about all this, could you? No, I, I don't really care indeed. At this point then, Giggity Salem makes his appearance fell unless there is a particularly fine fodder to be had. Therefore, we shall require a lure, and I have precisely the sort he will find impossible to resist. Simply place this true heart. I shall save the story of the origin of its unusual name for another occasion. Mm -hmm. True heart. Outside of the sp uh, Sigurans, Spriggans, Spriggans, Spriggans lair and wait for the opportune moment to pounce. As for the method by which you retrieve the crystal from his gut, I shall leave that to your discretion. Yeah. It is actually indeed level 40 for re. Um. I think we just go and take this gate and then take our chocobo. Um, uh, might want to rebind that in NVIDIA. There you go. Uh, seriously, I have to walk all that end. Oh! Well, alright, I'll run. Fine. Go over there. Yeah, we'll want to take the White Wolf Gate. And Chocobo, and let's go. be down here. Ah, uh, okay, they're quite... They're a bit higher level than the others. I don't mind. Might need to kill these guys first. Uh, and we'll fight a few more, it seems. Uh, always nice. Right, after this one, we'll have to get our thing up again.
I should also get my retainers. I don't have them. And I have a lot of stuff that I might want to keep or just get rid of. Oh, wow. He's huge. And nasty. Well, we got it. <laughs> Just like that. Just like that. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. go down. Ah, uh, pray do not sneak upon me like that. I was engrossed in- wait, what's that? What's that god-awful smell? It's a corrupted crystal! My word, that is Breathtakingly a beautiful crystal. I see my subst uh, supposition was not mistaken. Ah. And I also see you weren't averse to dig through the series in trails for your prize. So yeah, yeah. We went and searched his bowels. We owe our furry friend a debt of gratitude, you know. This tick coating of digestive juices is protecting us the harmful effect of the crystal just as the worn pot uh, you once used it why so gloomy friend you finally obtained the corrupted crystal you sought one overflowing with earth aspect ether calm down I jest I jest it is compressed of ice aspected ether don't worry I suppose that joke was a was in poor taste, considering your previous two attempts were for not. Yeah, that's not funny, man. That's not funny. Let's talk to him again. And it seems we're going back to sit, getting stuff we can't use at all. So might as well just go for the gear. I don't see why you would actually, from of level like forty, take gear. You you get get good set. Just take that. Take money. We take money. Beg your pardon, Une. I forget to return your crystal to you. How could you forget? Ah. And there was a message from you from Professor Lambert. Something about a man named Marquis. Apparently the professor missed the intellectual simulation. Forgive me. I should have written it down. It occurs to me that I have yet to ask why you need a crystal. You haven't you you aren't planning anything nefarious, aren't you? It would reflect poorly on me and my research if it was used for evil deeds. Ah, yes, perhaps. It's best I remain ignorant. I didn't become the professor's greatest pupil by, fi fi by filling my head with unnecessary information. Alright, let's go back to sit. I'm actually very happy that this quest actually brings you back to Gridania. So it would be time to deal, I think then, with, um, what's her name, Garuda. Interesting. Greetings, ma'am, do you wish to proceed to your vassal? Yes, onward to the Enterprise. 
Oh. Uh, there's one thing I need to check, actually. Uh, system config voice. Do is voices on? Oh, it is on. Because I think we'll have some more voiced stuff coming up rather shortly. All repairs and modifications have been completed, you know. Once you bring me that crystal, nothing will stand between us and Garuda. So it will enter actually, I think it's like in, in arcs the game goes like uh, you have 0 to 15 which is like your starting quest and 15 to Ifrit, then Ifrit to Titan, then Titan to Garuda, then Garuda till I think like the end of A Realm Reborn. I think the game is in like that. Once we get New Game Plus. Oh, not voice, that kind of sucks. Uh, we'll, uh, I might just redo some parts and we'll do the voice stuff by, I don't know, like computerized voice and I will make them into short videos, purely and mainly storyline. And I will do that for class quests and stuff like that, but I just wanted to play through this on this character and see how it will go. I need to run some tests to be sure, but this looks to be exactly what we need. Worry not, Dune. It seems that your hand, uh, hard work doesn't go to waste. Okay. Go. The Enterprise is all already more than a common airship. But mark my word, soon it will become something greater, something extraordinary. This, this is me. This is what I was born to do. Money. That reminds me, I actually, I've never um, gotten the money... Like, I never sold the money, I think. Got some pouches over here. Also need to put these, like... Okay, let, let me clean up the... The stuff over here. You can go there, you can go there, you can go there, you can go there. Glamour Prism can go there as well. I don't see anything else that would be in there. Alright, never mind. Sword. Oh, there we go. Another one. Savage or Salvage. I usually just put them in my chocobo. Now, what we can do is if we have these level 1s and we kind of don't want to use them, we can go to that place in Talalan and then exchange 5 for 1, if that makes sense. I don't know. There we go. Lady of the Vortex, level 44, giving me money again. According to my test, the device is now functioning in perfect harmony with that crystal. Meaning we can leave whenever you're ready. But you must understand, test can only tell you... Uh, tell, uh, can only tell one so much. Until we approach the Howling Eye. Until we attempt to breach the barrier itself. I cannot be sure that this will work. I think it's only fair to tell you that there is a small but significantly significant chance that the crystal would trigger a massive. Hmm. Maybe it's better if we remain positive. You know, I want to thank you for reuniting me with my ship, for trusting in me to develop this plan for everything. You've helped me to rediscover a part of myself I'd forgotten. I am not the man I once was, and I do not know if I ever shall be. But I do know one thing. This feels right. My apologies for suddenly outpouring of sentiment. I would have waited until after the mission, but... Well, you'll understand. Bitch. Ah, there. She's ready. Finally. Ah, she stirs. Okay. Yeah, that's awkward. Why is he touching his hand? 
and an audience with the Harpy Queen Garuda. Enterprise, engage. Make it so. This is such an epic team song for going into like a, a battle. Airship, and I was not alone. There were adventurers on board, adventurers like you. Oh, this is a bad moment. Just how long have I worn these damn goggles? Ah, <laughs> yes. I fancied myself a trendsetter in my younger days. The young prodigy, admired by all, exactly like his father. Born and raised in Garlemald. It was only natural that the precocious young student should become an engineer. Had his father not done the same? Father, when did we stop seeing eye to eye? When did Meteor become your everything, and your loved ones cease to matter? You abandoned us all, but he was there for me, father. There for me when you were not. I thought it, it, it was his father. Though he proved no better in the end. Gaius was just another man with an all-consuming obsession. And so I ran, left the Empire behind, and came to Eorzea, where I built the ironworks.
fuck am I doing there? That was me, right? Ah, yes, it was then that I first donned these goggles. Eorzea opened my eyes. It was home to so many manner of people, each with their own hopes and dreams. People worth saving, and so I fought beside them. I wanted to prove that my knowledge could serve a nobler purpose. I wanted to prove that there was another way. And it all began that day when I found my new home. I had forgotten how wonderful it was. The wind in your hair, the endless sky. That light. It was you, wasn't it? It's surprising how few people know this, but all pure-blood guardians have a third eye. Perhaps mine helped me recognize you, or perhaps it was just a lucky guess. The Enterprise was made for this. To carry Eorzea's protectors into battle. I am proud to be able to call her my own. Sid? What exactly do you remember? Alphinord, my boy. Sorry to have been such a burden. I remember everything. And it's good for you, man. My name, my people, and my purpose. Everything. Come, it would be rude to keep Garuda waiting. Okay. Oh, I guess we made it. Uh, all our efforts, all our travails, all of it was for this. Make ready there for the end is nigh. Be it hers or our own. Lady Highly I is now accessible. Can I just speak to all for not? Okay, well, well, that's done. Uh, with another group of players. Howling Eye, level 44. Let's join. We'll see how it will go. I, like I said, man, I've, I've never done tanking. This is the fir very first time that I'm actually playing a tank character. So hopefully it won't take too long. So uh, reshuffle that. Now we don't have to stay here. I kind of want to get one of them high elixirs and elixirs to get those two minions. Because I do forget otherwise. But we'll see how, how fast this will actually go. Uh, I think I should be able to... Get one from the company. Never mind. Let's go. Waiting for 2 DBS. Uh, do need to remember to actually get the file on. And we don't have that last skill, level 45. But we do keep the gear. There we run. Who dares intrude upon my sanctuary? 
Your incidents shall not go unpunished, Landtalker. Okay, can we fight? 12 preserve. It sees. Sees huge. As I live and breathe. Let's go. The exile. Uh, look over there. That's it's everyone there. They've captured them and them. They're much under cobalt prisoners, but why the exile bring them here? Because they're going to be trolls. <laughs> uh, wherefore come you hither, foolish mortals? Garuda. Well, uh, we are come. Uh, we are come to put an end to your reign of terror. Can we fight now? It is blasphemy, my children. These land walkers would bring me low. You who, you who are bound to crawl upon the earth, should reverse me, for I am the wind. Hey, how you doing, man? Dangerous wife. Well, hello there. Look at you. You married her. I think. That's a great match. Please do not take to the skies and slip the defenses. We're bound by nothing, Garuda. You think your plaything give me strength? Okay. They will not help you here, Landwalker. This is my realm. Here, none can challenge my superiority. Struggles though you may, I shall slake the roots with your blood of festoon and con canopy with your end. My god, that's disgusting! Slay the unfettered ones, we shall. As an offering to Garuda, they will serve. Alright, let's go. Engage! Hey, come on. Fight! Leave the exile to us soon, and we'll keep them distracted while you deal with her. Sounds like a plan. Do not fail, Una. Remember, you fight for the science of four eors, yeah. Well, how about you? You don't fail either, Alphanod. Let's go! This you would die by my own hand. Come then, I shall grant you what you seek. <laughs> okay, seems insane. It's going to be fun. Let's go. Everyone's waiting. Heck yeah, I love this song. Oh yeah, this is good. I love that. So good, man. Okay, we should get that timing up, so we'll start with... Oops, wrong one. There you go. Just in time. Yeah, I like this. This is really nice. Yeah, this should be fine. It's not a hard dungeon or anything. Do I actually have that skill? Interesting. And now we need to go. There you go. Done. Nice. Like that. This was quite easy. No, no, no. No. That's dramatic.
Anyway, they dealt with an entire army and I dealt with one of these um, primals. What? Well, now in the how in the seven hells? <laughs> this is my realm. You have no hope here, none. Uh, did you truly believe you could defy a god, Landwalkers? So, uh, how are you doing, uh, Tentured Wife? Uh, okay. Like that. My power is limitless. My children, Legion. And they have rendered unto me the wealth of crystals. Their gifts sustain me, their faith empowers me. None save uh, my children, uh, none save my children will escape the reckoning mortals. And those who would use my crystals to awaken the rest shall realize the folly of their faith. Oh, that's why the others are here. Hey, Prowl Ivan. Then all shall worship none but me. The one true God. Okay, she is absolutely insane. Of course, worship. As long as the exile keep praying, she will never fall. Time to slay the entire exile. That's it. They all die. Now let's stop them. Okay, massacre. That's it. Ah, okay. Maybe not. <laughs> No harm will come to you, my children. Wait. Wait. This is only beginning, Landwalkers. All who oppose me shall suffer for their defiance. Can we go ahead? Fight too? Hard mode right after this? Soon. The worms of the forest shall receive my judgment. The desert vermin next. Their wall of stone will not shield them from the tempest. And then I will take my revenge on the sea lies. Their wooden boats cannot outrun the wind. Tremble, mortal, for I shall visit you all in time. And all shall be mine. All mine. Okay. You, Landwalker. You who dare to raise your hand against me, you shall be the first to pay for your sins. Not with your, not with your death, but with your life. You will serve me, Landwalker, to your last breath. That's going to be difficult. Yeah. Ah, uh, no, no. I claimed you. You should be mine! <laughs> Look at that guy, man. That is... That's nice. Oh... Ah, a flair for the dramatics. Yeah, that's, that should be the final crystal then. What? What are you? What have you done to me? Oh no! Oh, that's quite sad. No mortal should possess such power. This, this is impossible. Everyone gone. That's fine. Do we get anything by that? Not really, but that's fine. Let's go. Uh, the Howling Eye. 53 minutes remaining, huh? Taking a break right over there. Oh.
Why do you not tremble at my might? Why do you not beg for mercy? Why do you not die? We've done it! Ah! Impossible it is! Kill you all! Is that all? Wait, what? Oh, Lady of the Vortex. Oh, mighty Garuda. Okay. What the hell are you doing here? Of all primals, the most terrible, I say again, is that all? Gaius. Ah, uh, Sid, my boy. You look well. For one who has forsaken kin and country. I wonder what else you will forsake before the day is done. What? What exactly did you hope to accomplish here this day? I... Well, I shall accomplish far more. I want to have I want to have one of those Seems very effective Is that all? Is that all? Insolent mortal I shall make you suffer That foul stench I see now She has touched you She very well. Seven hells, does she still mean to fight? Our oh, Lord of the Inferno, Almighty Freed, brought us succor in our hour of need. Save us, Titan, Lord of Crags. Oh, it hurts us so, the pain. What is she? Twelve preserve. She cannot mean to. But is she so? She's fucking summoning them. I don't think Titan looked good at all. No, no, this is all wrong. Stop gawping, boy. We must run. Just for one guy. Surrender yourselves unto me. I would feast upon your ether. None shall stand against the wind. Bear witness to the glory of the Empire. Okay. Oh, he's not taking no for an answer, that's for sure. of dealing with your kind. Now, look on their ultimate weapon, Icon, and despair. Yeah, we had... Oh. 
I was going to say we have the high ground. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh, that's disturbing. The second he got her, or it got her. Magnificent. It exceeds all expectation. I should turn off the uh, the sound from when I'm making screenshots, actually. Who the hell is that? With each primal it consumes, it grows more powerful. A marvel, is it not? Such is the fate of those who oppose the Empire. There will be no warriors of light to save you this time. If your leaders are as wise as they are reported, they will surrender. Your skills are impressive, but they will not be enough. Oh shit, man, he flies. Those wings are tiny. Strong as well. Twelve, have mercy. What chance have we against such an ungodly creation? And who was that armored devil? That was Gaius Van Balsar, legatus of the 14th Imperial Legion and supreme commander of the Garlean invasion force in Eorzea. Of course, the Black Wolf. How could I not realize? Grandfather mentions him in his journal. I was never so naive as to think the man would abandon his ambitions. But these developments are beyond my worst expectations. What have you been doing these past five years? How could something of this magnitude have escaped the Alliance's attention? Because the Alliance are idiots. We heard no whispers saw no signs. In the wake of the Calamity, the Empire seized land and built outposts, but that was the extent of their aggression. Damn it, guys. Where in the Seven Hells did you find that thing? It has been a day of unexpected developments, but the fact remains, Garuda is no longer a threat. While I take no comfort in the manner of her downfall, it does mean that we may safely put the matter of the primals to one side, for the time being, at least. Which just leaves the matter of Gaius's new toy. Indeed. That weapon poses the greatest threat to Eorzea. It must be destroyed. But first, we must needs find out all we can. Let us make for Vesper Bay. We shall rebuild the Scions. All is not yet lost, my friend, for we bear the light and shall surely lead our people from the darkness. Okay. That was actually quite easy. Well, that was an experience I would rather not have again. Something has been troubling me, eh? Shortly before the Black Wolf took center stage, when Garuda attempted to claim you as her own, I could have sworn I saw... Ah. But I'm sure I was mistaken. In times of great stress, the evidence of the eye is apt to misread, uh, to be misread by even the most inquiring mind. Forget I mention it. Return to the subject of our earlier discussion. We may consider the matter of the primals closed until further notice. No beast tribe will dare summoning their god as long as this weapon exists. Truly, a more effective deterrent I could not imagine. It almost seems a shame to plot its destruction. Aye. Yeah, we could take the woolen tunic. 
But we know we'll get a like a new suit. Rel Actually, I, I was thinking of this one then. Uh, let's try it on. Oh, no. Oh, no. N that's not happening. I don't like it. Uh, we'll go for the money again. It's good cash. It is past time that we turn to the walking sands. To leave our headquarters in this repair any longer would be a dishonor to the memory for those who fell there. We have been brought to our knees, but we will rest, rebuild, and rise once more. Okay, onward to the walking sands then. Uh, how is the state of my gear? Yeah, actually quite good. Oh, I spy with my little eye a new dungeon. Interesting. Kind of want to do it. Uh, going for gold. Oh, yes, this one. How nice. Uh, people really don't like it. I find it not too bad. I've done it a few times. Here we go. I can't take two steps around this place without hearing Une this or Une that. Why is it as if you're some, some kind of goddamn hero? But I jest. Even I can see you're just itching to find new battlegrounds to hone your skills. Unfortunately, I know just. A, unfortunately, I just know the place. Aram Vale. Head southwest through the central highlands of Chorus and seek out a man named uh, Willemus. And tell him that Network has sent you. Okay. Now, we will do that. But I kind of also don't want to waste this one ticket. You don't have too many. And I kind of want to make sure that I'll... Uh, I'll be able to go through the story. And we'll, we'll definitely go into Aram Vale. Uh, which I think is like level 44. Not sure. Would be nice if we were to like be level 50 or so, but you know, it's not necessary. Look at how gloom and how dark everything is in there. Tell me, Unin. Does art here strike you? Does art here strike you as art? I see signs of recent habitation. Could it be that we have trespassers? Map, it's just my imagination. Come, let us proceed into the solar. Wait. Plant a bomb. Oh. Who goes there? No, no, either. Is that any way to greet a friend? Off we not, Une. Sit. Wait, is this a dream? Not that I'm aware of. It's been a while, yeah, either. Or either. I don't believe it. I was sure you'd been... This place has seen better days. I um, don't know. Uh, uh, you know, I wasn't actually here when I was still in talks at the Atlas Nest. The first I knew about it was when I came back and and I saw Ida. The church has taken care of the bodies, but that still left the stains. It was hard to know where to start. If Eustola hadn't been here to help me. Oh, Eustola's here as well. Eustola, yeah, even Alphina's like, what the fuck? Yes, but she's not here right now. She's gone to Ulda to meet a man who might know what happened to the others. Papalimo and Minfilia weren't taken, uh, weren't amongst the dead according to the church. Eustola thinks they were taken somewhere else. Upon the orders of the Black Wolf, no doubt. Why would he want them? Because they possess something he desires. Knowledge of another power that can be brought to bear against the primals. One that Gaius has yet to harness. How do you know that? 
the echo. Gaius will uh, will be aware of its existence as well as its immunity to grant the gifted to the primal's influence. Powerful though this elegant weapon may be, he would doubtless desire he would doubtless desire such protection. He means to use Menfir to gain understanding of the Echo, none of which explains how the Empire came to know the location of the Walking Sands in the first place. We have a red. I think we have a red. No matter, the Empire has shown its hand, and now we must act. It is up to us to rebuild the science and save Eosia. Can I count on you, Ida? Wait, oh yes, yes of course, whatever you need. The gloominess completely gone. We can discuss our next move upon Nistola's return. For now, I say we rest. I'm sure it will have to be sent to like quarters. Oh, he takes it very literally. Here, feel. Think. It's like we're inside a, a bit of a Russian story, I don't know. A lot of voiced stuff. That's disturbing. Crystals, thy soul burneth bright. I am Hydaelyn, all made one. Hearken unto me now, for the darkness doth begin to spread. Wear thee the bearer of the crimson brand, for he is the avatar of shadow. Whom death attendeth always. The crystals shall be thy salvation, thy blade and shield both. Steal thyself, for at the appointed hour thou shalt stare into the heart of darkness. Go with caution, my child. But fear not, for I am ever with thee. Ah, Nistola. Nistola! Une, I see you and Orphanod are safe. And, and sit. That we five should meet each other uh, does defy simple explanation. It is as if the benevolent hand of Master Lewis Swar guide us still. He would not see us undo so easily, or undone so easily. Not now, when the need is so great. I know where Menphilia and the others are being held. Where? An imperial stronghold in the heart of Mordona, Castrum Sentry. All right, let's let's go smash up that place. Ah, uh, we can take on Primals. We can take on a few soldiers, right? Go in blazing. I think that's what we want to do. All right. Uh, now, before we can continue, I will let the dogs out, and I need to return a call because I think my furniture is going to be delivered, which I am really, really happy for. So, um, I'll just do that real quick.
Uh, I'll be wrecked. Just give me five. All right, so that is all done. Thank you for waiting if you're here. And if you just recently joined, welcome. We're currently on MSQ level 44, probably going into 45. We have Into the Gold, Aram Vale, a dungeon that we could do. And I kind of want to do that. Stone. I've done all of these. I might as well just do that one as well, right? Yeah, why not? Anyways, let's go talk to Yustola. And yeah, I, I don't want this this armor. I, I, I hate it. Uh, I don't think it looks good at all. Anyways, Jason the Castrum. The rescue of our allies will be no small undertaking, Une. Even under normal circumstances, breaching the defense of an Imperial Castrum would be a highly dangerous proposition. But now the Castrum sentry houses prisoners whom the Galleons deem valuable. We might be confident that they have taken a have taken additional measures to ensure the strong or skirted, so it's even more difficult to breach them. If we are to free our friends, we will require an effective strategy, and we will and if we are to formulate an effective strategy, we will require intelligence. I believe I know a man who may be able to assist us in this. Lord Porter Porter Lane of the House during there. He is stations at the observatorium in Cortas. Let us go to him and breach his aid. Besiege his aid. Okay, well, if we go there, we might as well just do um, Aaron Vale. Because we do need to be here, and one mission is there, and the other one is there. Let's go to Dragon Camp. Who's actually online currently? A uh, few people. Joke was 30 minutes. I will start with Aramville. Because I think that is the one that is... You know, it, it's good. it's fun to do a dungeon. It's fun to do a dungeon. I know I need to stick to the left side of it. And then uh, we'll just see how, how it goes. As a tank. I've never tanked it. Up until the end of Heavensward. I've played. Before. Okay, that's a... Frog being attacked. I've actually a crocodile attacking me then. Yeah, and I'm actually thinking when we do hit uh, the end of A Realm Reborn, I, I think I want to start leveling my... Maybe my Gatherers? I don't know if they would be very effective in the Diadem. Or I should just wait until the Diadem. I'm not sure, but I, I do want to like get at everything. Uh, especially the like the level 50 nodes you'll get they're quite useful to have in bulk some of them and some of them you can just easily sell also in bulk there with my money 215,000 anything I can take in bulk I'll take could also do more dungeons but I don't want to bore you guys with that so here we go. Uh, Williamus. Hail adventurer, wait, don't tell me. Nidrick sent you. Tell me this adventurer. Do you know how the Aram Vale earns its most enticing name? Well, allow me to enlighten you. The cave is rich with sulfur and mithril ore, which do reaction with the groundwater combined a excrete golden Golden hood fumes. A beautiful sight, that is, until you realize the damn, damn death clouds are burning your chest from it. Oh, nice. If you still wish to take, uh, take your life, if you still wish to take your life in your hands, 
I'll not be the one to stop you, but if you try, uh, but do try not to get yourself killed. I've dragged enough corpses out of the veil to last me a lifetime. Interesting. I, I don't have any rings of that level. Strength, vitality, dexterity. We also just take gold. We could buy rings before we enter. I'm going to take the money. I think we do kind of want to buy new rings. Think. Yeah, do we? Do we care? Yeah, we do. We are not level 47. So here I am, making plans for things that I am unable to do until the next level. Great, I love that. Uh, anyways, let's go. No need to bulk or sulk over it. Let's just continue the MSQ. At level 50, we'll get that new top, which will actually prove us very helpful or useful. And I don't think Aram Vale is that much of a that that big of a deal, as long as you take the medicine that's on the ground, like with the. I think it's like the final two bosses. Oh. They'll, uh, they'll poison you and you need to be... If, if you have two or three, you'll need to take one of those fruits that's on the ground. To get rid of the poison, otherwise your healer is going to have a heck of a day. Being annoyed as hell, I can promise you that. So, yeah. Careful with that. Uh, we need to be up there, probably. Do we? No, actually, he's over here. Yeah, of course, he's over here. Uh, what do you... Ooh, you have something as well. Ah, Une, the woman who unmasked the heretic in our midst. To what do I owe the pleasure of your company? You are the associate of Ustola. But of course, Lord Drillmond conf uh, confined to me that you were a scion of the Seven Dawn. Um... Uh, let's take the money. Before we start that mission, we'll talk to the, the other guy there. That's another dungeon. Gastrum Sentry. What interest have you in... Uh, what interest have you all in the Imperials? They hold several of our numbers who we intend to free. Any information you can provide will be greatly appreciated. I see that might explain our scouts' reports. They observe four prisoners being led into the castrum. A Yugan woman, an Elzin man, and two Lillafels. One male, one female. It is them. It has to be Minfilia, Uranje, Uranje, Uranje. Yeah, it's, I think it's Uranje. Papalimo and Tataru. If that scans morsel is one, uh, is. If that scant morsel is of use to you, you may also be interested to hear about the most recent incite incident. Incident? Incident. Oh my god. Incident. An Imperial airship made an emergency landing here in Cortas not long ago. Two men believed to be prisoners, uh, Rugadale and Lollafell, were seen fleeing the craft what did you say oh wait is this wait that could be his guys uh ruga din and a lot of fell master Gorland. garland neither were imperial dress and both seem in decided to wait for rescue hence our assumption they were prisoners well i'll be damned bigs and wedge trust those two rascals to escape we must find him in end soon. The Imperials will not give rest until they are captured or killed, and if Biggs were given a choice, I'd fear he'd take the letter. Fleeing, uh, uh, fleeing those held in custom Sentry will require substantial planning and preparation. As such, it is an endeavor that will emit some slight delay. The matter of the escapees, by contrast, will not. Shortly after the prisoners vacated the airship, our scouts observed Imperial troops setting off in pursuit. 
It's likely only a matter of time before they catch them. If you wish to see your comrades again, you best act now. And we will. After we talk to the other guy. If, as had been suggested, the Guardians took our fellow sword and uh, silent prisoner in hopes of understanding the Echo, it seems reasonable to assume that they will not be executed until time as the study is completed. But Biggs and Wedge are not science, nor do they know aught of the Echo. As Lord Portland said, this may prove our only chance to rescue them. I say we seize it. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, we all not. Thank you, everybody. You won't regret. You won't regret this. What was that shaking of the camera in the end? Yeah, that's cool. Oh yeah, that's cool. Oh, that's disappointing. Final preparations are almost complete, my lord. There stands the cumul cumulation, the cumul the cumulation, culmination of five long years of painstaking work. But all our efforts will be vindicated when the emperor's vision becomes reality. At last, we have the power to purge the land of the false gods. We shall give the ignorant children of Eorzea the security and stability they so desperately crave, and which their spineless leader, leaders uh, have so probably failed to provide. Bad news. As you say, my lord, rest assured our engineers will not rest until the weapon is fully armed and operational. Uh, Ritterin, you depart for Castrum Osidites at Mista. Okay, so he's going to somewhere else. You will command the Western Front in Vilbrand. Vilbrand. The Orsians will attempt to interfere with our plans. You will see that they do not. My lord, if this be your will, I shall carry it out to the best of my abilities. I live only to serve the Empire. Yet, forgive my impudence, but it is proper to give command of half your forces. Is it proper to give command of for to a... To a what? <clears throat> I have given you nothing, Perfectus. You have earned it. All... Uh, this will be all dismissed. Okay, so he's given half of it? Or the other guy he's given half of it? I don't know. Yes, my lord. That's weird. My quarters. What? Oh, man. That is no way to make a date. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The bedroom. One hour. Oh, that's what he... Yeah, he was doing... He was just, um... Doing stuff. What's going on there? Someone came online and go... Oh, yeah, he, he got offline. That's fine. Hey, what do you want? The Fort of Fear. Dark place on adventures may illuminate. And... Oh, what's the name? I have heard much of your doings, and I think you the woman for this task. To the west is the Zamel Dark Fortress. It was meant to serve as a new keep for Lord Desimel, uh, ever a friend of House Durin there. But before the mason and carpets could complete their work within the caves, Horde of Void Scent appeared and drove them out. 
In the years since, the creatures have consolidated their presence. As such, we officially petition your assistance in reclaiming the Darkhold. All arrangements have been made. You need only give your uh, as, uh, assent. Speak with the sir at the ingest if you are with us and see we'll tell you what you need to know okay sure that's over there dungeon level 44 let's see if we actually can enter it that would be nice uh let's go there it's quite nearby it's, it's up here i think Am I missing the entrance? Oh, it's... Oh, never mind. It's over here. Could not have built a bridge, eh? I don't remember this one. Welcome to the Dark Holds. Built to withstand all Ravonian ploys and plans. These were natural caves behind. Uh, these were natural caves behind me until House the Missile began to enlarge, connect, and fashion them into a stronghold. Alas and alack, the void sent struck interrupted the work. Alas, then, in the confusion, guardians infiltrated the keep. Alack, all is all. It was a fine mess. The guardians were eventually forced into retreat, of course, but the void sent remain. And so the fortress goes uncompleted, a home for abomination. Woe, woe is us. Yet the war with the dragons rages and we have no knights to spare for this noble mission. Even I am here strictly on a very long tea time arranged by Sir Con Wait, this is your break. Please see to this abominations, Madam Adventurer. Madam, I have a much prowess with the paperwork. You should require eight of all that of that sort. Okay, so you're a pencil pusher. Now let's take a look. Can we actually and we actually can? It's a labyrinth. Uh, sink from level 46. Let's do it. I, I don't know how it goes. Might be cool. Can't really remember. Maybe if I see it, I'll be like, oh yeah, is that, that's the dungeon. I kind of don't remember. that thing here
Yes, we won't need it. So we'll just keep going. Well. So apparently I need to stay within the purple. In the purple light to avoid damage if we stack in the blue circles to open the door. Uh, if the eyeball final boss tank, uh, tanked in the light or else he's invulnerable. Okay. Yes. Okay. Now what? Okay, when the light vanishes, run to the next one. So it starts to dim. I really have not done this dungeon a lot. Um, cool sunglasses, I guess.
Oké, okay, explosives. Nice. can do it. Are there more enemies? I can hardly see a thing down here. Okay, get out. I'll switch them. This is an easy boss. Easier than the other one, at least. There's no real mechanics. Okay, what was this F10 again? Raise yourself, let's do that. That was easy. Huh. That was very easy. So far it's been, it's been nice. Okay, that seems explosive. Yeah. Oh. 
I guess. Oh, yeah, the portal. Yeah. I'm just going to pretend that I did good. <laughs> right. Oh, it's one of these guys. Uh, didn't we fight one of these already? Oh, he seems pissed. What's his problem? Why does he keep flipping? Like, is that something special of his? Is the final boss.
How long have we been in this dungeon? Like 18 minutes already? I just don't think I want to stand in those puddles. Nice. Hey, right, we did it. Level up! <laughs> oh. Okay, that was nice. I like that. Ah, everybody gone. Is there any treasure? No? Okay, what do we gain? Oh, we got one recommendation. I like that. You know, they don't have to. <laughs> because I don't think I did such a good job. Um, but we did it. It's now level 47. That means we can do another dungeon. Uh, what did we get? Um, try them on. Can we... Can we... Please... Please display gear. Oh, yeah. I like that. Yeah, we need to keep that. Keep that. Oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, well, whatever. Actually, you know what? Equip that stuff. Uh, but this is a better weapon. Plus 11. Hell yeah, I'll take that. Ooh. Oh, no, I like that. That looks so sick. Uh, no, I don't care for that sword for that. Uh, let's go. Let's not do that. And update that. Could I... Yeah, I could actually do the helmet thing. Didn't realize that. Mm. No, we'll keep it like this. That's fine. This weapon is sick, though. It looks so cool. It's too bad it's hacking into my shoulder. Uh, speaking of which, we might as well just do the arm veil as well, then. To have all of them done. Uh, time is... Oh, we got time enough. Let's go run back to camp. This might take a bit longer. I don't think people are really keen on... Aram Vale. Hmm. Less than five minutes. Yeah. I don't know. Should we risk starting um like the story? Get rid of this, by the way. There we go. I don't know if I like Steel Cyclone. The radius is five. Five, five. So the radius is all the same. Tomok is nice, but I'm thinking we'll start using like overpowered and stuff more. Home gang. You can actually stop them from moving. 
arm's length. Do I get slow or do they get slow? Slowing enemies when attacked. Immune to almost no. Oh, we need to use this more. More than this. And I'm thinking... Vengeance is still nice. The inner beast? I'm not sure about that. I don't know if we should use the inner beast. Let's put you in there. Let's take a look how we would do it. So I would put Tomok on 6. Overpowered and steel stuff over there. Home gang like this. Good inner beast. Like this is all... Yeah, something like that. Alright, do we have anything going? Less than five minutes. They're not lying to me, game. Oh, actually, we've got 19 already. Nice. Uh, I know we could do... Like... Title... But I don't care much about that. This one, this guy is nice though. I'm hoping to get like level 50 so we can deal with. Um, Curious George. That would be nice. Five minutes average waiting time. Come on game, don't fail me now. How is my chocobo doing, by the way? Very near. Very, very, very near. Come on. Less than five, huh? Okay, ancient lumber. We can't, we, we can't do that. I don't know any of them. A few more days until we can go for a new house. We have an eye on a medium house. So I'm looking very, very forward in getting that. Come on, man. Get this dungeon done. Oh, well, whatever. We're going to have it right when we start this conversation. Oh, wait, what the fuck? This is actually a bit more strength. I like the tenacity, though. Oh, this is... Yeah, I know what this is. It's like, cannot equip gear to feet. So we would lose 120... Yeah, no, it is definitely worse. Never mind. Never mind. Okay, let's go. Whatever. We'll wait. We'll see what happens. We're waiting for a healer and a DPS. My purpose here is to re... Con... Cointer? Reconnoiter? Reconnoiter. Galleon activity along the... Ab 
Palatia Spire. Owing to this, I have the honor of being acquainted with Justola. Now, the report of Imperial Airship Emergency Landing came to us by way of the Missile Darkhold. Oh no. Don't tell me I have to go there now. A man stationed at the entrance by the name of Beldrick may be able to tell you more. So, as to the expedition to your mission, I shall furnish you with a letter of int- No, pray to him nice with your comment. Oh no. No, oh, no, don't tell me I have to do it again. Like, we don't- you just done it. Oh. No, they would not make a blue mission if it's a story one. No, they wouldn't, right? Oh. <laughs> I don't mind doing the dungeon, I don't want to do it if I don't have to. Stand before the dark old subterranean fortress excavated by the Great Iskanyan House, the same name. This meal. None but authorized personnel. I, mean, I just, I already got in there, dude. Don't tell me. Let, okay, you can. So you have come about Imperial Airship. According to our scout, the vessel had scarce touched the ground when a pair of men, captured by all accounts, uh, burst forward and bolted. Imperial soldiers have since been sighted in the area seeking to recapture them. What? The captives are alike to be your friends, you say? Then let us pray. That they are yet uh, that they are yet a step ahead of their pursuers. The emergency landing reported took place near Aram Vale, situated southwest of here. So that you take a search there. Seek out the knife knight named Um Baramons. You should be able to see Oh thank god. I kinda didn't want to do that again. Look. This one I do. Let's go. Aram Vale, apparently one of the most hated dungeons. All I know is you, you stay to the left at the start and then it's just a bunch of killing everyone. Everyone and everything you come across. Lucky we don't target anything. I'll take it slow. I don't care what they think. Uh, we don't have to rush this. Survive? No, it cannot. Sorry.
Well, at least the left side is empty. Well, we kind of failed. Oh well, you know, it is what it is. All we have to do is make sure that whenever we hit like two, maybe three, is take one of them fruits. Probably the one behind me. It's one. That's a random... Okay, we're still on one. Now we're on two. And on three, we'll take the item. If you eat fruit, you're a coward. Okay. <laughs> I like that. I really do like that. Okay, so I'm definitely... Hey, we get a new minion. I don't have anyone. Let's just, let's just need it. And um, this is... Yeah, I think definitely my gear is a bit of an issue here. I'm definitely on the gear. Thank <laughs> you. 
I really need to focus on my rotation. Because I'm not doing good. I mess up my first 1, 2, 4. And especially later when this becomes like 1, 2, 3. Way too often. So I might need to take some time. And just start hitting one of our practice dummies. level 50 will get like a new skill one apparently that's going to be on my free so I've been told go in whatever I don't know what that one skill is that we just got. That's easy. Um, oh yeah, let's not do that. I don't want to divert anything. particularly sure still why I died. And I'm still going to be blaming my gear. I think that I am too low geared. Oh, 
also, I have that debuff for, you know, dying. Oh, boss time. I don't know, man. This front, this, this, these dungeons are getting difficult. More, more and more difficult, at least. Oh, he's ugly. A lot of fruit over here. Yeah, that's one. Gear is starting to pour in. Alright, the healer is going to have a nightmare with me today. So far, so good. It was my fault. I got up to four. Well, we did win, and we won. Actually, quite nice playing as a tank. It's it's hectic. I love it. Everyone's gone. All right, that's fine. Uh, fruit. Do I need fruit? Yes, I need fruit. Otherwise, I might eventually die. Let's eat it. I have two. Fruit, fruit. Ah, I wonder what we got. Hopefully, it's going to be nice. Something that we could use. That would be great. Alright, let's take a look. Inventory. Paladin. Ah, that just sucks. Uh, magic. A marauder, another weapon, another weapon. Let's take a look at this. Okay. Right. I don't like it. We got the um, the minion. Um, do I want to place that somewhere? Sure. Minion roulette. Damn ship. Again. There you go. Weird, weird, weird beast. I don't know what they do. Is that a minion there? Sick amount of a of, of like armor you'll get. Where the hell are you going? 
Uh, the Eyes of the Empire, let's go. We're still doing MSQ stuff. We did two dungeons now. I quite like that. We're level 48. Might as well... Ju it just might as well be useful if we do our daily. Our leveling daily. Uh, we'll also get some points which we can use to... I don't know, like up, uh, upgrade our rank. We need to go all the way there, I think, to like lieutenant, and then you'll get like your own squad. And the squad itself, I. Yeah, well, it's there. It it will get you to like second lieutenant and possibly to captain. Other than that, I don't know, man. Imperial airship, I I saw it approach to land. Uh, with my own two eyes. I hasten to the landing site, arriving just in time to see that vessel take to the sky again. But not before it had deployed a detachment of troops. Gruff orders were being barked. And there was an air of consternation about them. Consternation or concentration? I don't know. Yeah, I'm not taking that. I don't want to. Let's take that. Uh, two fugitives. They were prisoners. Uh, they were prisoners aboard the airship, it seems, and they seized the opportunity to flee when the vessel was forced to land. The guardians who were deployed formed search parties and proceeded to scour the wilderness in order to alert. In order to alert our forces, I returned to my post to find evidence that someone had been here in my absence. Whoever they were, they tried the door to no avail and decided to go elsewhere. In all, in all, I marked two sets of footprints, a large and one small. If, uh, if you search the area, may I find you'll be able to follow these prints to their owners. Okay. Footprints, there we go. Do we want to do the, uh, the dungeon, the leveling nest? They are looking for a tank. Could do that. Alright, let's, uh, let's do this mission first, so we still have some progression. And then we go. I'm very happy that I made this larger. At least I see when things go wrong. And I, I still don't understand why I died with the... Um, what's it called? The Marlboro? 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 I honestly don't know. But... We're extremely close at getting to 50, so we can do the... I think that would be like the final mission of the Marauder. And, and, and then we have to decide. Like, do we get Paladin to, to take a look how that class plays? Like, we, we could do that. It would hold the MSQ for a bit. Because, well, it, it, it's, it's still time we have to put in. And I would still need... A few hours to get them up to level. And the gear. Don't forget about the gear. Something under the bridge here. Oh, it's a wedge. Hello, wedge. So cold. I want to go home. Please don't eat me. I am not nearly as succulent as I look. It's all skin and bones underneath, I swear. Une, it's you. Thank God goodness you're here. It's been it's been awful. The guardians were snapping at our heels like a hundred pack of wolves. I was so hell bent on evading them, I almost ran headlong into a monster's jaw. A gaping mo uh, trice. More tries. And when I finally found cover, 
It hit me how cold and hungry I was. I just... Give him food. Biggs. He, he isn't here. He went off a, in a different direction to lure our pursuers away. It's me, Sid. Have you had any success? Why can't he not just contact him? Track down Wedge, that's wonderful news. Now, what about Biggs? I see. Well, it's hardly surprising me and that big fellow went, uh, went off. Me and that big fellow went off as he did. For all the tongue lashes he gives Wedge, he always takes care of him. I've scouted the area surrounding the Darkhold, but have nothing to show for it. At any rate, we know for a fact that Biggs had West bo uh, with both I uh, Ida and just stole the helping out. I'm sure he'll turn up soon. Now then, I'll make my way over to your position while keeping an eye out for Biggs. If memory serves, there should be an Isgarden fortification not far from your west. A, mo uh, a monument tower, I believe it's called. Let us meet there. There I hope, was that Master Garland you spoke with? After five long years, thank godness he's alive. It's goodness, not godness. I feel better now, you know. Let's go to Monument Tower and wait for the Chief's arrival. Let's not trigger every monster we come across. It's Guardian Pilgrim. Oh, I think that's from the Faith. Here we are. So kind that the is Guardians just let us in. Well met and welcome, adventurer. What brings you to the frozen corner of the realm? Oh, it would seem your companion has caught a chill. Come and warm yourself by the fire. I'll bring you to hot, and I will bring you a hot broth. Sounds like a plan. How are you feeling now, then? Stay here as long as you need. The same goes for your friend. This pains you to have a. Um, it pains you have a hard journey ahead of you. This. Plain, you have our journey out of yourself. How could I misspeak so many things? You must find rest when you can. At least we're making money, which is good. And that means that we are one level away. So I do think I want to do the, the, the leveling dungeon. And we'll see what we'll get. I probably doubt a lot of people... Oh, never mind. Never mind. Oh, if it would be Ifrit, then that would be great. That's that's going to be lovely. 7, 8, 9. 7, 8, 9. This one's already grayed out. It's 45. 35. 32. Okay, this one's not grayed out. What is it going to Oh, it's going to be... Drumroll. Ifrit! Well, I'll be damned. Yeah. Means half of my skills won't work anymore, but it's fine.
I don't expect a level from this. I if I would, then I would be very, very surprised. Alright, so there we were lucky. GG. Uh, play accommodation. Let's go with the Conjurer. Did his best. And I completely forgot my enmity increase. Hey, there we go. Will I? No, okay, look at that. We didn't level. Well, we got half a level, which is still fine. We got some money. We're at 250, and we have enough uh, seals to actually level up. Let's continue. I'm fine now, thanks to you. But I can't bear to think what Biggs is, uh, but I can't bear to think that Biggs is still all alone in the cold with guardians on his heels. He lured the enemy away for my sake and now he's suffering for it. I hate to have to rely on you again, Une, but do you think you could search for Biggs? I haven't the slightest notion where he might be at the moment, but maybe, just maybe, the people here have seen something. Uh, wrote a gentleman dressed in the same manner as your companion. I'm sorry, but I didn't come, I did not come by here. Hmm. Let me think a moment. I would not raise your hopes on Dali, but there is a cave situated a short distance to the south. Uh, we call it Fury's Gaze and may be worth, uh, maybe a worthwhile to investigate. I think this suggests this. I think I made this suggestion only because your friend seems to have a selfless sword Rather than drawing the enemy to the tower, may it be elected to pass us, pass us by. Oh, that's actually quite nice. Yeah. And I should really slow down reading, because I actually make a lot of mistakes. I've been trying to sp uh, just, just speak a bit faster, but, you know, failing miserably at it. Uh, we could also do quickly do the guild test. Wait, to the south. Wait, I'm I'm going into the wrong direction. I think. Yeah, definitely. The guild test itself doesn't give you that much in terms of XP and all. So I'm not sure if that is something I want to do. This is a nice cave. Yeah. Where would he... I'm going to be assuming they will be fighting. Yeah, of course we do. Should have done it like this. Messed that up. Heal himself? I don't know, man. I'm, I'm just not, not doing any damage, it seems. He is fully silenced. What's he down there? Now, this Shriek might be interesting if you're having like an 8 man and you want to pass enmity to another tank? Perhaps? Otherwise, I don't know what you would use it for. Well, there was no one in there. It's a bloody shame. Okay, yes, which? Une, were you able to learn anything? Not in this, uh, not in this area. Well, that stands to reason, I suppose. Seeing as he was trying to lure the guardians away from me. But 
where, uh, but where within the where within this vast sea of snow and ice could he be? Ah, it seems like we found him. There we go. We can't give up hope, you know. We must find Biggs before he succumb to the cold or is recaptured. There must be someone in this tower who can help us, even if it's only a te uh, only to tell us where else to look. Ask them for me. Ask anyone who will listen and hurry. Big's chances of survival grow slimmer by the moment. Okay, we need to go up. It's a long way up. Wow. It's a very, very long way up. And we got... Ignace? Ignace. Ignas. Ignas. Your friend is lost in the wilderness, you say. If he's not to be found around here or in the vicinity of the Dark Old, it's possible he made it for White Brim. To reach it, you must travel through Denef Pass, the southern end of which lies to the north and east of here. While I make no guarantee that your search will bear fruit, it is surely better than worrying in idleness. I wish you luck. Oh, and one more thing. Do dread weary well cli uh, while climbing the stairs here. Not a moon ago, I near broke my neck when I slipped and took a tumble. Oh shit, man. It, it, it's absolutely a long way down. Let's take a look how long. But oh, that's not too long. There you go. Okay, so onward to... Notorious Briggs. Level 44 still? Come on, man. I, I need to at least get 40... 45. I was absolutely aiming on doing 5 levels per stream. Guess I failed. Miserably. Oh, okay. Level sinking me down. Look at him go. Oh, I couldn't read that. But I'm probably like you're captured. Why don't you come and find out, Tinat? What's. Uh, see, it's mimicking him. Why are you mimicking him? Ah, uh, Une, it's well that you're here. The situation is grave. Big is in the. Is a bad way. Big is in a bad way. We need to do something right now. Oh, there's a right of it. He will perish if we delay. With me. Charge! Epic battle cry. Why is he just... He's not alone. Kill them all. Yeah, you can try. You, you can definitely try. Everyone on me. Hey, right, there is. I'm not sure if someone is able to do any healing. I just wanted to make sure we got all of them. You stole us putting on chains, so you see, he's stopping them from movement. Someone here is healing, and I don't like it. Are you healing? Oh, he's the healer, I think. Yeah. 
That was easy. My thanks. Another moment and I would have been... I would say would have had... You know... Bleh. He has been too long in the cold. We must find shelter for him. It's not like you're overly dressed. Woman Tao, you say very well. Eden and I shall bear him there with all haste. Sid will be so happy to see Biggs and Wets again. Ah, oh, I love reunions. Uh, I was going to check. Like, oh, well, we actually got twenty-two now. Nice. Yeah, but I do have to, I have to do more dungeons, that's for sure. It's it still feels weird thinking. And I know some of you might be looking at this in the future and like, what the fuck are you talking about, man? So easy. Hey, is witch? I cannot thank you enough, Une. And the same goes to the rest of you. Thank you all so much. Oh, don't mention it. We are a family, are we not? Well, well, yes. It's just, it's just, I didn't think, I didn't think I'll ever see him again. I owe you lots. Uh, I owed a lot of you my life. And you saved Wedge too. Una, I lost count how many times I owe you. Quite a bit. Let's pay up. And that is it. Wait, wait, God, it's good to see you two again. Chief. It's you, it's really you. In our hearts, we knew you were still alive, but to finally see you in the flesh. When Alphina told me of the raid on the walking sand, I feared the worst. What happened? The enemy struck with nary, uh, with nary a warning. We didn't stand a chance. Wedge and I were in the workshop when they came. Before we knew what was happening, the Imperials had us at gunpoint. It must have been awful. There's one thing I don't understand though. How did the Guardians get there so fast? I mean, the Immortal Flames should have seen them coming, right? I myself have asked the same question. The day when I returned to the carnage at the walking sands, I noted not a miss in the horizon, nothing at all to suggest the passing of an, of an imperial force. From this, I conclude that the guardians came neither by land nor by air. Nay, they were born there by potent teleportation magic. Magic. Of the kind used by the Askians. Oh, that makes sense. Carry on. Okay. We were bound. Uh, we were bound and blindfolded, and bundled into the cargo bay for uh, of a waiting airship. I can't rightly say how long we we were aboard, but when the time came for us to disembark, we found ourselves in the midst of an import of an imperial stronghold. Gastrum Sentry. Upon arrival, we were marched off into the main complex. Biggs and I were thrown into a detainment cell together, while Minfilia and the others were taken elsewhere. That was the last we heard of them. Gastrum Sentry? Yeah, nobody knows. 
What happened next? Well, we were held in an isolation for what felt like years, but was probably moons, or maybe only weeks. Then, without warning, the Imperials collected a pair of us and put us on another vessel, which we found out was bound for Garlemont. Much to our dread, we knew that if we were taken there, back there, we weren't like to leave again. So risky though it was, so risky though it was, we sabotaged the airships, altitude control, and thereby forced an emergency landing. And in the midst of the ensuing chaos, we managed to slip our captures. The rest, as they say, is history. How did they sabotage that thing? Ha. Ah, if I didn't know better, I'd call that a likely story. Sabotaging the altitude controls of an airborne vessel. That will, ha uh, that will have been Bink's handiwork. Like as not, and it worked like as not, you always were resortful in a tight spot, my friend. Unit, thank you for returning my dear assistance to me. It would seem I owe you yet another debt of gratitude. There are still many questions in my mind, but the answer can wait. Minfilia and the others still want for rescue. Alright you lot, Garlemont Iron and Ironworks is back in business. Let's go give the Imperials what for. Rah. Still level 44. I was actually expecting it to be level for, uh, 45 now. Thank you. Biggs and Wedge are with us again. Now we must find a way to rescue Minfilia and the others. God knows we've been keeping them waiting for far too long. Based on what we've learned, it's believed... I believe it's safe to say they're being held at Custom Sentry. So let us convene... To Reverend Stoll in Mordona. It's as good a place as any to prepare. And better than most, the road leading east then south will get you there. When we arrive, let us seek the advice of the local adventurers. We're bound to learn a thing or two that will benefit our mission. Wait, I've not attuned there? Where the hell is this? That's Reverend Stoll. Oh, of course. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, never mind. We'll, uh, we'll go by Bert. We'll go by Bert. So, once we get to 50, I think it's most important that when we switch to a new class, like one of the others, like the White Mage or the, um, the Ninja, we make sure to keep doing dailies on the tank. Now, we won't get new missions. Like, we, we have the same dungeons, which is fine. But I do need to make sure that I keep practicing. Is there anything else over here? There is just tooling around. I'm going to assume that is for crafters.
And now we have a tune there. And we have Slavborn. Well met, friend. What brings you to Reverend's Toll? Did I hear you right? Your friends are being held captive at Castrum Sentry, and you want to rescue them. I don't mean to discourage you, but that might prove difficult. The stronghold has been on high alert of late, with armored patrols seen about the perimeter around the clock. Not even a fly could get in, uh, could get within a hundred yards of the walls undetected. If the Guardians were alerted of our coming, we cannot know what they will do to Mintfilia and the others. We must act with the greatest stealth. Aye. It, so, uh, it has to be good old-fashioned infiltration. But when security is so tight, how are we going to smuggle ourselves in? Why, I have a mind to, um, uh, I have a mind to walk through the front door. Uh, front door? Aye. We'll disguise ourselves in Imperial troops and march right in. For this, we need a few sets of Imperial uniforms. A suit of Magitek armor and impeccable timing. Ah, that's a bold strategy, but it just might work. Where we are, there is certainly no shortage of supplies to borrow the equipment. Knowing those Imperial bastards, they won't even suspect that we, selves, that we savage Eorzeans would think to use that technology. Then it's settled. I... If you determined to go ahead with this, I'll recommend you speak with Glaumund. The fellow's got a personal grudge against the Empire and happens to know a deal about Castrum's uh, sentry beside. I've no doubt that he'll... That he'd want to be of eight. Stoll and I uh, go to Reconir, Recontier. Rec We're going to be scouting out Galliavin activities in the stronghold. It would not do if something were to befall our comrades before we had a chance to act. Come and join us when you're ready, you know. Let's do this. I. Sometimes I wonder, Ida, are there ever times when you are not enthusiast? Enthused? Yeah, I think there are, of course. I'm nothing if not enthused, Istola, and you are beginning to remind me of Papa Limo. That's harsh. Let's see if this is going to be 45. Looking for a garment, are you? Well, you found him. Whoever you are. Alright. You're looking to get inside Castle Sinter. As Castle Sentry, and you need my help. Something tells me we're going to get along just fine. Yeah, what was this mission now? Still level 44, huh? I want to get to 50. There we go. Let's see what we can do. So you have friends in Kestrum Sentry that want uh, that uh, uh, what want to re uh, what want for rescue. That staff bore knows me too well. I you can count on my help. I've got a score to settle with the Empor Imperials, and I never pass on the opportunity to get back at the Orsons. But enough about me. Let's talk strategy. Rescuing folk from captivity, right? Delicate. Uh, from captivity's right delicate business. A single oversight. Just one little blunder and it's all over. You can't leave any room for uncertainties. For starters, you need to confirm beyond the shadow of a doubt that your friends, uh, your friends are where you think they are. You don't want to risk your neck only to discover they've been moved elsewhere. But how can you find out, you ask? By following these instructions. If you approach Sentry from the east, you'll see a swampland to your left called the Tangle. Get in there, never mind all the morbles, 
and navigate your way to the southwest corner. You'll come upon some drainage pipes coming down from the stronghold. Don't ask me how I know, but one of them leads back to the command tower. If you listen closely, might be as you can eavesdrop on some of the happenings within. Once we know for certain your friends are there, we'll move to the next stage of the operation. Now, get going and Godspeed. Okay. Will do. Last time I played, like, I got in from the North Teladon, I had to go through the base. That was quite awkward. Saw things I shouldn't have seen. Only one online, that's new. That hardly happens ever, ever. Let's see how many have been online today. All the way over there. Nice. That's a good mount. That's half of it. Nice. I like that. Oh, I hate I hate those. I hate those. That's fine. So I'm going to assume we need to be somewhere over there. Well, he said no, not to mind the the mobile. So we won't. And there is a bunch of draining pipes. That should be it. Yeah, let's go. So uh, the faint sound of conversation echoes down the pipe. What of the captives? Does she still refuse to speak? She may as well be a deaf mute for all the information we've gotten out of her. The others aren't much better. The Elzen gets on my nerves most of all. Every time he opens his mouth, it's only to sprout gibberish. Ah, oh, okay. Tension toughing then. I do wonder why is the Tribunes so obsessed with this Minfilia woman. They say she possesses some magical power, something we guardians don't have. Magical power? Like the kind of the kind the beastmen use? How am I supposed to bloody know? If you're so curious, why don't you ask the tribunes yourself? Has well tried to tumble her. I like my head where it is, thank you very much. Your break, our break is over. Best get back to our stations. Um, okay, so they walk away. Big to Elf North. It's good to see you again, Hune. I'm giving to understand you have conducted some reconnaissance. Tell me, what were you able to learn? So, Minfilia and the others are indeed in Kestrum Sentry. Their presence thus confirmed we may proceed with the mission. 
while you were afield, set to the liberty of diversing a plan of action. Pray have the details from him. Good work, Rene. As Alphinot has already told you, we have plotted out a course of the rescue. The gist is it. The gist of it is unchanged. We disguise ourselves as, impo as imperial soldiers and infiltrate the stronghold. Uh, Glaumund is looking into ways to procuring a suit of Magitek armor. In the meantime, I need your assistance for some preparation for my own. Minfilia and the others are counting us on us, Une. Let's not keep them waiting any longer than necessary. So bloody close. While Graumund goes about diversing his plan, we need to see to some preparation of our own. It wouldn't do if the Imperials were to discover that we're short an armor. To prevent this from happening, I'm going to put together a makeshift communications jamming device. The explanation is like to get a bit technical, so bear with me. Imperial forces communicate at a distance via an electromagnetic, uh, electromagnetic wave. Simply put, voices are born upon ethereal lightning energy that permits the air. Now, the hill-sized cluster of corrupted crystals to the west has been observed to amplify the self-same energy by making us of the, by making uh, uh, by making use of this property we should be able to drown our should be able to drown out imperial voices to ensure that we have enough amplification we must identify the most potent crystal among the cr uh, the cluster for this i need you to go there and use this device to take readings i'll mark the likely place on your map Oh, and just so you know, plasmoids are drawn to lightning energy. Don't be surprised if you run into a few. What a bloody frogs that is. Should be this one. Definitely. There's one. And I believe the up there is one. Prime location. Of course. the next one over there we can walk circle here no might as well just kill you you're going to be pulling me anyways which is annoying and there is the prime location If I don't get 50 now, then we'll have to do the next one later because I'm getting very tired. And I have to some stuff to do. Like, you know, picking up my wife and all. Has to be hostiles. Yeah, I knew it. And I think I do want to get 
uh, the Templar. They use the same armor that I already have. <coughs> wow. <coughs> Sorry for that. I have a mute button. Just forgot to use it. Okay. Then the way up is here. Five thousand. Ah, uh, yeah, that's not going to be enough. But we have a tiny bit of rested XP. It's going to be do or die, I guess. Here we go. Sit. You have the readings. Excellent. Here, let me see the numbers. Yes, four of these crystals should suit our purpose. Though I pray we won't have any need for their power. My thanks, Cindy. No, no we didn't. Ah, oh, well. Ah, oh, well. 46? Wait, we just skipped. I might just go for another half hour. I don't care. Dogs are eyeballing me. It's fine. Uh, we'll get the Imperial Salute. Wants to practice the part of Imperial Trooper. Clean the wax out of your ears now, cause there's something I want you to do by way of preparation. Wait, you were one of the troops, aren't you? Oh, look at that smile. Oh, that's disturbing like crazy, dude. The plans to have you enter Castrum uh, Sentry all decked out, all decked out in Imperial Duds. But a disguise is more than just clothes you're wearing. You're also going to act the part. At the very least, you need to know how to perform a, a, a con convincing Imperial salute. First impressions are everything, as they say. I could teach you the salute myself, of course, but it's best to learn it from the expert. So get yourself near as, get yourself near as you dare to the Castrum Sentry and watch the Imperials do what they do. Yeah, the last few missions probably will go very fast, like level 46 already. And here I was thinking that I would need more classes. I could have done it by with two. Um, so that would have been the, most likely the ninja. We need roughly 14,000... And this mission will give me 25. So that should be enough. Let's keep moving. I don't need to fight this Nyx. Like this, and now do the normal attacks. Oh, I'm on my feet. Oh, that's actually. I have a skill for that, that I never use on the F10. <laughs> Nothing to report, sir. We 
We have received an anonymous warning that insurgent forces are near. We must redouble our vigilance. I shall recommend patrols to be increased. Well, hate to be them. Wait, that's it. Use a mission, and the next stream might be very interesting. Then we'll uh, we'll most likely save Minfilia. Sounds like a plan. So did you manage to learn the Imperial Salute? No, no, no. Best you don't demonstrate. I'm liable to fly into a rage and crack skulls. I'll just take your word for it. So we've learned the Imperial Salute. And we leveled. Here we go. Onward. And this is the one, Storm's Eye. Apparently I want to keep that up at all times. Um, it goes after Mame. As a potency of 380. It's the same. Uh, Grand Surging Tempest in... Oh! Oh, it actually does grant the same thing as this. Surgeon Tempest, increasing damage for 10%. Duration, extends uh, duration from 30 to 60. Okay, now that does... Extends Surgeon to duration 30 to... Um... Fine. Go to George, that's the final thing we'll do because I want my gear. And we'll do this mission dressed for conquest uh, tomorrow, actually. And I think we'll start off tomorrow by doing some of the... Yeah, do we want to do the dailies? I kind of want to just want to finish a Realm Reborn. And then we can sidetrack ourselves a bit more. Here is uh, Curious George. Uh, weapon, gear and infuriate. Increased beast gauge by 50. Can only be executed by, uh, while in command. Okay, well that's nice. Don't think I'll use it too often, but might be a good to start. Doing it as much we must discuss, but now is not the time. You surely recall my mention of the hunt for the bloodthirsty creature terrorizing the small folk. I've just received word that self-same monster has been sighted near Wineport. What is more? A what is more, according to those who managed to escape the carnage, the creature appeared more man than beast. If this is true, then our quarry could be far more dangerous than any wild animal. We must find a way to stop it. We must find a way. Ah, oh, we're going to be fighting the marauder. This is my chance to prove to the people of Wineport, nay, to the world, that my tribe and my art have been wrong wrongly judged. Perhaps then my ancestors will deem me worthy. I think even my brother would do too. I think it's your brother. I think it is your brother, dude. I'm sorry. There is no time to lose. We must arrive at the hamlet before any of the villagers fall prey to the beast. Let us leave at once. It, it's his brother. It needs to be. It just, I can't envision anything else. It is his brother. And maybe his brother will be our next mentor. I think there's nothing more after this. Or maybe not. Where's the captain? Yeah, we're level 50. That's fine.
Thank the gods for your presence. Wine port is in your debt once more. Fell creatures bear down upon our village in hordes. As if drawn by a great hairy beast, you must stop them. Una, you fend off these creatures. I will see to the beast. This is my battle to fight. Okay, now we'll start doing that weird thing. Okay, so it's 60 seconds. And now we can do four. And we'll just keep going. Wait, that's it? Oh, that was easy. That was so easy. They're all huffing and puffing. It's the, it's the beast run for your lives. Yeah. It's his brother. Stop. These people are not your enemy. The enemy lies within. You are stronger than this. Take control of the beast. Do not let it consume you. Brother. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Look what you are doing. You are destroying all that I work to restore. The faith of our people rest in your hands, brother. Your weakness would cost us everything. I cannot let that happen. I will not. Our ancestors have chosen me to lead our people to glory. And no one shall stop me. No one, no one, no one. Oh God. Yep. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. It was I who unlocked the secrets of the Chronicle. I who trained you in their ways. I who uncovered the location of the, lo of the legendary artifacts. I who defended my tribe's great defeated my tribe's greatest warrior. I am the master now. I am the master. Return to me what is rightfully mine. Give me the armor. Or I shall tear it from your bloody corpse. Ah, he's so friendly. Cute George, they call him. Let's go. Yeah. So we'll start with this uh, rotation first. See what happens. That's just 30. And then we do it another. Ah, there we go. It just gives it... It starts moving it up. In a fury, huh? Are they going to be attacking me? I don't know why those inner furies are here, to be fair. Not that it really matters. I can't move, I believe, because of that chain. For two more seconds. That's it, George. You died. He's now uh, dead, George. I have failed. Yep, now give me my armor. 
I failed you, I failed my people, I failed my ancestors, and I failed my own kin. I found out long ago what had become of my brother, but did everything I could to deny it. I thought that if only I could prove my, uh, myself stronger than he, the people would see his madness as a product of a weak mind. That they would believe the problem lay in him, not in our tribe. Yet, all the while, my own soul was growing weaker and weaker. The inner beast had taken hold and it would not let go. It drove me as it drove my ancestors, the keeper of the armor of the armor and my brother. Our tribe had lost sight of who we were. In seeking ever more strength, we allowed ourselves to fall victim to that which we had so long scorned in others as weakness. Instead of learning to harden our will with resolve, we steeled them with anger and therein lay our folly like a bonfire anger burns hot and bright but when the fuel that feeds it is spent all that remains is ash by accepting anger as our guide we left our wits at the mercy of the inner beast but not you your will is more akin to the lava which courses through the mountains of my homeland. It burns as strong, nay stronger, than any bonfire, than when it cools. It becomes hard and firm, unbreakable. This quality allows you to keep your inner beast at bay. Oh yeah, give me my armor. Oh, we, we, we deserved it. There you go. My people were once as you are now, Une. And I believe that is why my ancestors chose to speak to you. They sensed true strength within you. Such strength as could rightly represent our people and our art. Had I but realized that myself, none of this needed to have happened. Well... What's done is done, and I, I am, if I am to have any hopes of restoring my people's name, I must start over and, uh, I must start over from the beginning. And this time, I mustn't try to do it alone. It may take time, but together my brother and I will restore our village to its former glory. And when we have, I shall remember Une, my friend and fellow warrior, and how she saved me from myself, that my dream might become reality. Give me my gear. And that's, that's my four hour mark. Usually I go free, I've been going a lot longer than I usually do. Uh, the wars of ages have passed the ball, but that was too fast for me. <laughs> okay, that's great. Speak to the militia captain. Wineport is in your depth once more, Une. And what is more, we have seen the truth with our own eyes. Pray tell Curious George as much, that we will be relying on him for his protection. He is a true warrior. And our humble hamlet would be lost without his strength. I feel like a bloody... Oh, it's the wrong one. I feel like a bloody messenger sometimes. Here I was, I was thinking, that in my inventory, now I can see the gear. Nope. No, oh, I have to go talk to him. He is now... In his usual place. I wonder who's going to be my next teacher.
We'll see. See what happens. Why is he always with his axe out? Welcome back, Gunnar. Despite all that transpires, the captain at Wineport would entrust his village defenses to me. I, I don't know what to say. It has been a long road, but thanks to you, I have rediscovered what I lost so many years ago. I will see to my brother's wounds, and once he is well, we will embark on the path of the warrior again. Engraving the lessons we have learned in our souls, never to be forgotten. Uh, curiously, the moment I did avow this to myself, my soul crystal began to shimmer anew. I see yours too, glowing, glow stronger than ever. It would seem my ancestors have once more bestowed their knowledge upon you. This, this power, why this is a power that I have, why, why? This is a power that I have only read about in the tomes. Nay, the power entirely beyond my comprehension. The thing that I once doubted my resolve. No, you have truly uh, conquered your inner beast and become a true warrior than I could ever have hoped you to be. Knowing that you stand before me as an equal of my tribe's greatest heroes, ever steal your resolve, Une, and go forth into the realm and protect those who need your strength. With your representing us, the redemption of my people, a new era I seek. The new era I, era I seek is surely close at hand. There you go. And now we'll get the message that you cannot continue until after a few missions. Yeah, infuriate. Yeah. See, a realm born untaken, so you must meet the following requirements. Before the dawn! Is the next and uh, next mission? So yeah, let's uh, let's gear up on the beach. Weapon. Wait, what? Equip that. So we have this gear set, and immediately we get another one. Oh, it's red now. Okay, so they changed the color. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that, that's that's nice too. I'm I'm disappointed. Yes. Anyways, guys, that's it for now. Thank you so much for hanging out. Appreciate that. And I'll hope to see you next time, which is going to be tomorrow. Uh, have a good one. Bye-bye. Uh,